So that was a that was a good victory, and you really seem to enjoy that as well. No, oh, yeah, I love it. Listen, I love Dan. I do love I do love a war. So got a good little war there in the end. So yeah, good. I'm glad I'm glad. Like I said, I've always said it. When I get a fighter that's going to come to win and come, who's actually going to throw at me, that's when you'll see the best of me. Um, I got hit with a couple of shots in there as well. I did get hit for it, so I've shown I've got a chin as well. So yeah, happy days. It's all part of the learning experience. He was coming forward, like you said. It's, it's, that's what you wanted as well. No, I hundred percent. Like I say, I ain't, I ain't been in the ring. I've been I fought once this year. That's it. So got the rust out. Um, hopefully next year, get going again, getting a lot more, lot more fights. That's something we're going to touch out. One of the reasons you've been out the ring is because you've been changing camp. How, how, how have you found that? Yeah, I moved to um, Peacock Gym. Yeah, very good down there. We've got Martin, Eric, um, Andre, Adam. Very good coaches down there. And it's good. It's good to have four different coaches. You know what I mean? You've got like you're learning something different from each each coach. You know what I mean? So it's like. I'm only going to get better, aren't I? And listen, these coaches have been about a long time. Eric, former former champion himself, do you know what I mean? Like, who better to learn from? You also seemed in there very confident. Is that something that you've been working on? Just the, the whole team, you know, is that coming into you and you're, you're feeling more confident in the ring? To be honest with you, I, f I felt the pressure today. Listen, I, like I say, a new gym, you've got to step up, you've got to show that you've made the right decision, do you know what I mean? So this is probably the most nervous I've ever been for a fight. I kept it, I didn't show it, but, mate, I was shitting myself earlier. I can't lie, bro, I was shitting myself, but... Uh, yeah, listen, this is what we want, isn't it? So, happy days. Perfect timing as well, just before Christmas. Now that, that nerves can then go away, even though I didn't see them. So we can go in to push really hard next year. Is that the goal? 100%. Listen, I love Christmas so much. You see, I come out of a Christmas tune as well. Um, yeah, I can't wait, can't wait to spend Christmas now. have, have Christmas off. Um, I say have it off, I'll still be ticking over. I'll still be training. But uh, yeah, definitely have, have a good Christmas. I love Christmas. <laughs> Well, hopefully don't love it too much because we want to see you out very early next year. That, that's what you're aiming for, isn't it? No, I'll, I'll love it enough though. Trust me, don't worry about that. I'll get, I'll get, I'll get the most out of it. The next year, eight rounds, is that the goal? Four times eight rounders? Is that what you're kind of thinking in the back of your head? Yeah, 100%. Listen, I got the rust out of there today. Um, it was a good pace fight as well. We weren't, we weren't a slow pace, so I showed I'm fit enough. Um, yeah, man, listen, listen, whatever Andy thinks is best for me, Andy, my manager, whatever he thinks is best for me, I'll, I'll go on to do. Well, congratulations. Go enjoy that Christmas that I know you will. And um, we'll see you very soon, Sonny. Thank you. Let me just shout out um, Barry Turner and Sons, um, Dudley and Co. LTD, and Healthy Ways and Ace Project. Big thank you, guys. Listen, without them, I wouldn't have been trained. Like I said, I fought once this year. Um, the funds have been low. So without them helping me, I, I, I wouldn't have been able to do it. So big up, big up all them sponsors. Thank you very much.